Here's the quickest, easiest way to tell if the person you're dating is a narcissist. Just tell them no to a request that's even mildly important to them. Oh, you want me to get dinner with your parents after date three? No, I'm sorry, that's too soon. I don't feel comfortable doing that. Oh, you wanna spend Thursday through Monday with me? No, I'm sorry, I have a very busy weekend. I won't be able to. If you are getting an instant guilt trip, that is a narcissist trying to rule you with guilt from the get-go. If you are getting anger or rage, <laughs> just run away from that, seriously. That's not gonna end well for you. You should be getting from no, something along the lines of, okay, I'm sorry, I know that it's so soon, I just got a little excited about you. You let me know when you're ready to meet my parents. Narcissists will immediately love bomb you to force a false sense of intimacy quickly. They need you to feel emotionally strapped to them because they know that this love bombing phase is quick and fleeting. They can't sustain it forever. And if you tell them no, that will immediately puncture through their mask and let you know if they are faking it with you or if they're legitimate. Without you even knowing it, oftentimes when people are love bombed, they never say no. Even if they're feeling uncomfortable, they're like, this is moving really fast, but I don't wanna let this go. This feels so great to get all this attention. What if this is my one shot at a big romance? The narcissist without ever saying anything directly is going to make you feel like the relationship has an expiration date. By trying to push along these big milestones, meeting their family, meeting their kids, moving in together as quickly as possible. And they can only accomplish this if you are willing to go along for the ride. If you say no to them and you take the relationship at your pace, you essentially become immune to love bombing. So start saying no to them and clock their reaction because people aren't perfect and sometimes they'll react in a weird way. But if this is on a consistent basis that this person's not even listening to you, this person's forcing their own will onto you, that is a major red flag that you could be with somebody who has big control problems like a narcissist. I've got a book on Amazon called Navigating Narcissists. The link to that is in my bio.